dies. It starts first time every time. Every time. <laughs> starts every time. My name is Sam Wood. I'm Richard Wood. And welcome to the Spud Drive. My name is Steve Jones and I'm one of the founders of Teton Gravity Research. We're here at the illustrious Spud Drive-In for the world premiere of TGR's new film, Under the Influence. Being able to premiere the movie here at the Spud locally is a great opportunity for Grand Targi. It's a good coming out party for us. You know, for Targi, it puts us on the map as far as being a real destination. It gives us a great opportunity to show the world what we can have. We were lucky enough to have Sage Catabriga Alosa, Sammy Carlson, Taylor Felton, Dash Long, Dylan Hood. I've got Mark andre Bellevue trucking people up on a snowmobile. They took down all the stop signs. Super stoked to be back here in Teton Valley, and uh, I grew up here, up in Alpha, Wyoming, and uh, grew up skiing at Targhee, so this is hometown, and uh, it's really sweet this last year, you know, I always skied at Targhee, you know, growing up, and then throughout the years after I uh, moved away, coming back, you know, each season for a little bit of powder, and uh, this last year was really cool because we came back for a specialty shoot after the mountain had closed, and we built a bunch of unique features, some big jumps, and it was just really cool to be back at Targhee. One of the jumps we built uh, was in this like classic jump spot that everybody knows about and everybody hits, uh, called Rock Chuck. And, you know, the zone that I had skied, and you know, with my friends like Jack Pilo and stuff that we just skied every day and it was our backyard and now I got to film there with, with TGR. When we first got this bid to do this project it was, a, it was a big thing for us at the end of the season. The season was over, we were closed for the season and we get this big, this great opportunity and uh, Grant Fleming, the director of Mountain Operations, decided it was worth doing it. We kept Charlie Harker and Eli Preston around and they drove pre cats and they built these great hits. Yeah, the wedge was built on lighting. It was a, it took a couple days because the initial build was was not what the athletes wanted or what they needed, so they had to rebuild it. And there was a lot of snow to have to be moved, and it took you know it took a long time to do it. But those guys had you know those operators were great, and the ability to, to rebuild it the way the athletes wanted it to be built was you know a testament to the operators that we have at Targhee. They did a great job, and the one over on Lightning Ridge with the sunset over the big holes. And, just amazing and then watching the cats actually work run on rock chuck jump was great it was just it was really fun and i believe those guys had a good time doing yeah, it yeah my name is josh nielsen i'm supervising producer for teton gravity research uh, and i was also a principal cinematographer for under the influence one of our major goals going into this film was to bring a different level of production we kind of call it our, our special ops and that kind of means that we bring in either new and special mounts, uh, jib arms, dollies, uh, different cameras and different camera techniques and, uh, and we actually had a, a, a really successful time this year at Grand Targhee. We, uh, we used a new RED camera which is a, an amazing digital camera that can shoot up to 100 frames a second that produces uh, an image twice the size of HD and, um, and it, it, it has this spectacular almost 3D look to it and so that was really cool and really exciting and 
Along with that, we, we had it paired up with this guy named Sergeant Fury, who's, uh, who's kind of like a stunt helicopter pilot. And so we brought him in, he, and he was able to, um, to fly super low and super close to the athletes, which helped us get angles that we've never really gotten before. So those two coupled together, I think, got some spectacular images and certainly some of the best images that we've ever got um, on, on jumps. Um, and of course, the, the third element that really uh, took the whole Targi jump session to the next level was uh, having really, really amazing athletes like Sammy Carlson. Sammy Carlson is a new guy that we brought in um, this year. He's uh, an accomplished X Games medalist and is just a workhorse. And he came in to Targi this year and uh, filmed for five days and put together an entire segment in Under the Influence, which is amazing because most of these athletes are working their entire year for this. And he just came in and just teed off. He uh, spent a bunch of time on what we call Jump One, which was that rock chuck. Uh, and it's just the wedge to steep landing. and. Uh, he pretty much killed it there. We got some amazing shots with the red camera on that jump with him. Um, and then he also like interpreted the Targi train in a, in, a, in a way that we'd never really seen before. You know, we uh, built a jib off the main Targi lodge, which was basically like a little step up onto a roof and uh, to a rail slide, to an air, to another roof, to another air. Um, and then also uh, like an air to an up rail. And then this crazy tree bonk that he did, which was uh, this really gnarled, old tree um, and he saw a way to kind of jump through it so he built a jump up into it and uh, as the session progressed he was able to you know start touching the branches with the skis and then finally like the grand finale was him basically uh, taking his hand and, and pushing off these tree branches into spins which I've never really seen before so he was able to actually do this jump where he jumped in through the trees pushed off a branch went to 540 landed switch and rode away and, and I was pretty baffled by the whole thing. Awesome. All right. I'm Grady Collins. Uh, Gage Davis. Yo, I'm like totally Mike. Um, Alec Davis. Kevin Gonzalez. Connor Collins. Nick Passion. J.B. McLaren. And head coach. Brady J. All right, so you guys just finished watching the TGR film. What'd you think? Awesome. Awesome. Great. Awesome. awesome. I have ski fever. Ski fever, big time, huh? Yeah. yeah. Anybody want to be a big ski movie star when they get a little bigger? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. What do you guys think about Grand Targhee? Awesome. awesome. Yeah. Does anybody have a big trick they're working on? I'm working on backflip 360s. Uh, trying to land my backflip. Uh, Lincolns. Oh, uh, backflips. 360. Probably a 720. Front flip. Probably a backflip, maybe. I gotta land my sick bird. The jump project we did at uh, up at Targi for this film was really, really cool. It was uh, it was pretty wild. It was definitely challenging. You know, we've done some of these projects uh, most recently at Aspen, and those guys build all the X Games jumps, and and so it really took a concerted effort from. Uh, the, the TGR camera guys and the athletes and all the Targi crew and staff and uh, you know those guys outperformed our expectations beyond anything we could have imagined. There were some tense moments when uh, you know are the physics of the jump going to work? Is this thing going to you know are, they, are the athletes going to like it? And the rock chuck jump in particular was really cool because we uh you know we built the wedge but it really had a natural landing so it's truly a hybrid style jump and and uh and then it it you know we got blessed with like a foot of snow and so all of a sudden everything we built was really like a backcountry jump that we just had the assistance of a wedge versus the boys building it and uh and you know sammy carlson was the first guy to hit it and he over rotated and 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 uh bit his tongue and almost you know was we thought he was done and then and then sage and the boys stepped in and just started killing it and uh it's really really rewarding experience to watch it all come together my name is tigger connect i uh i work for tgr in the tour department was just out doing uh the portsmouth new hampshire show boston new york show equivalent pleasure to uh to be working in uh in idaho at this drive-in you know it's, it's such a unique experience and it's unique to any one of our shows. This is this is hometown. It's right over the hill. It definitely culminated into a little Teton Valley, Idaho love between Victor and Driggs. 
We're sitting here at the Spud Drive-In. Yes! 